Ever wondered about the secrets of productive people? Yep, there are secrets. In fact, it's not so secret because many of them are generous enough to make known and let you and me know what it is that they've done and what has been the secret of their success. Productive people, successful people, they write goals. Here's my wonderful, beautiful little journal. Get something that inspires you, ladies. Um, or it can be a plain notebook because it really doesn't matter what you write it in. If you're not committed to it, then it's really the same. But they write goals. This is something I wrote some goals in. I wrote uh, dozens of affirmations and goals and declarations for 2019. And I've decided that I am going to see them through. What do I mean by that? I revisit them daily, sometimes two, three times a day, depending on my schedule. But certainly once a day, I make it a point, I make it my, my goal to revisit those, repeat it, hear myself say it, hear my, envision myself doing the thing that I am decreeing and declaring. And you know what? I'm at the point now that I believe them. I believe everything that I am saying. And so it really is very, very simple. You repeat it enough, you say it enough, you develop a schedule around it, and you yourself will begin to be one of those productive people. Another thing that productive people do, I'm just looking at my notes, they have a checklist. And so you heard me talk about the fact that I made dozens and dozens of goals and declarations and, and, and just uh, setting the vision really of where I see myself and what is it that I want to accomplish this year. Well, because I am so certain of what it is that I am doing and I feel so good about it, I know it's going to be come to a point very shortly throughout this year that I'm going to be able to check them off one by one, one accomplishment after the next. And so I am encouraging you to do this, to develop this wonderful strategy for yourself. You will find very, very soon and not before, way before December 31st. In fact, by December 31st, you would have had new goals that you have checked off your list. But get that list going. The important thing to do first is have a set of goals, write them down, and then you will get to the point where you will have a wonderful pen along with your journal to check them off one by one, check them off. The third thing, and by no means this is not the last, but the third thing that I'm talking about today, they have me time. It's very, very important. Productive people know when to shut it all down and know when to get to a place, whether it's a destination, a location, or sometimes in their, just in their home, a, a special room in the house, and they have me time. Me time is very important. It allows you to refuel. It allows you to refocus, sometimes to heal, to declutter. Me time allows you to refocus. Get some me time in 2019. It's important. It allows you to go over those goals, to check off some of the list, and also to rediscover new things about yourself, new things about what it is that you want to do, perhaps to tweak it and uh, refine it. If you want to be a productive person in 2019, take advantage of some of these habits that I've just shared with you and you will find that you will develop even new habits and expand this list. But you must start with one step and one decision. Get started.